All right, so this is Fisher with GeekBattleRoyale.com, and I'm here with Jacqueline Fleming, or you prefer Jack, right? Jack is good, J-A-Q. <laughs> and you see all these different movies you played in. I just want to ask, you played with so many different actors. Who was your favorite to work with? I mean, you were working with Morgan Freeman in Red. You were played as Terrence Howard's wife. I mean, obviously, Mickey Val, and, and that's where y'all friendship came yeah. from. Vegas Vampires. Yeah. Um, entertainers that work with have brought something different to yeah. the table. Some have brought a lot of personality. Some have brought, brought a lot of craft. Um, some have just brought wisdom. I just finished a movie with Laura Dern and James um, James Hurd. And, and James Hurd is, you know, an icon in the industry. To be opposite him in the scene was like, whoa. It was pretty intense. And Laura Dern, she's a beast. Yeah, absolutely. And I mean, a lot of people always judge. They're like, oh, they're probably jerks off scene. But I mean, from what you were telling me, I mean, everybody seems like they're just great to work with. I've actually had a very uh, wonderful experience in the industry working with actors. And, uh, you know, Nikki and I did just my love together. And that's, yeah. you know, we've done several movies. And, um, you know, yeah, I think everybody was cool. <laughs> <laughs> and the best movie you worked on, you kind of said that you enjoyed the most was. Beast of the Bering Sea? I did, but I'm, I'm not going to lie. This movie that I'm working on now, I think it tops every film that I've worked on only because, one, the director is Marcus Dunstan, and he did The Collector and Saw. He's doing Halloween Returns. He is the most amazing director to work with. I, I, I've worked with hundreds of directors over my career, but there's something so special about Marcus, and he's huge at these comic cons. It's going to be a ride. You know, after he's like doing all these saws, and now you're gonna play this role in your character. Yeah. This is gonna be a villain. Well, a my character, character, she's she's um she's a cop and she she runs the town. Oh yeah. But uh, don't call her for help. Uh, <laughs> is, so is there any kind of like I guess plot details? Nothing like yeah, that gives on, it away. It's but on IMDb. Um, it's called The Neighbor, and it's, the neighbor. it's basically who's your neighbor? It's filmed in Kent, Mississippi. Yes, we're filming in Kent. Mississippi and the cast is wonderful. I'm working opposite Josh Stewart, who starred in the Collector and um, and the collection, and he's an amazing actor, really is. And Alex Biso, she did Starry Eyes, so I'm opposite the both great cast. What I love about your filmography is that you played these big budget movies, but you also played in these indie movies, and you're yes. supporting the indie movement. Yes. And uh, the local production company sketchy characters you played as the Bourbon Witch. I right? sure did, the Green Witch. The and Green Witch. <laughs> and I, you know, when I asked the director, Armando Le Duke, I said, why, why would you cast me as that, in, as that role? Why do you think I could do that? And he said, you're a laugh. And I, and actually I have a distinctive laugh that is known. People in LA, I'm from LA, used to ask me to come to their screenings because you could hear me laughing throughout the whole theater. I think we found a new Harley Quinn. <laughs> that would be perfect. People know me by my laugh, so Armando was like, your laugh. And I was like, wow, okay. I mean, at first you're like, I want you to be a green witch. What are you trying to say? <laughs> like, it better know. be about my laugh. <laughs> but, you know, he's, he has this vision, and I'm looking to see where he evolves into as a, as a director. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's all exciting work. and. Mm -hmm. You know, you filmed a, a lot of local New Orleans movies like uh, Contraband. Oh my God, that was amazing. I really enjoyed it. Kate Beckinsale was so awesome to work opposite. She's so, she's so cool. She is amazingly cool. That's good to hear. Uh -huh. So just about everybody. And Morgan Freeman, he was cracking jokes the whole time. I, you know, he treated me like it was Holly Berry. I was like, oh, you're so sweet. I would ask him just to read. <laughs> His voice. <right? laughs> Like, for me to go to bed, just read, yeah. read me a story, Morgan. Yeah, and I just um, <laughs> recently worked on Zoo, which is shot in New Orleans. So yeah, it's a uh, James Patterson book based mm -hmm. on book. So I did Zoo. And so, it's, you know, it's been an incredible um, journey as an actor. This is my 20th year in the film industry. I'm going to be able to I have never been so. You definitely made a lot of waves in that 20 years, and I really appreciate you coming onto the show. Yeah. And please check out... Jacqueline Fleming at Jack Tang? You can you can follow me at Jack Fleming and Jack is J-A-Q. Jack Fleming. Thank you.